Uh oh, moose. Oh no, moose. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> but I was happy oh, no. because I found one thing that I wanted, but then I found something very, very rare. And it's an Okinawan beer, which is really hard to find. And, Didn't you uh, mention that the other time that, uh, we were playing yeah. this, actually? Oh, that you have well, family that, that from Okinawa? We, yeah, we went, yeah, I have family from Okinawa. Uh, when we went to Ajumayo is what I was talking about last time, and that was, like, on a quote-unquote sale. But I found it today at, like, the local, like, generic Asian market for cheaper than it was on sale at the Japanese market. And I was like, ooh, because I don't have to drive, like, 28 minutes, and I don't have to pay so much. I'm just happy about it. Yeah, understandable. Thank you. Got some help here. Oh, this boy. So Hold we're trying still. to take Thank this you. down. Ooh, a little above me. I gotta get better at finding interesting things to drink, because I, I don't like bitter anything. You don't like, you don't like bitter? Mm -mm. Well, uh, no, we bitter, should hang out. Bitter stuff yeah, yeah, is most. not... Like, I, I really didn't like the margaritas last week, because they were, they were too, like... Just well, you, you just then... You pretty much sour? can't have alcohol at that uh, point. You, unless you no, have no, the no, grapefruit like, one, I think, right? Maybe no, I didn't have the I didn't have the grapefruit one. I had the oh. I had the sunset or sunrise, which oh. yeah, I probably oh, should have tried this is, more. This is last week when uh, you and and some stump folks and Moose went out. Yeah. 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 Okay, cool. Uh, you should try their horchata slushy. <laughs> okay. Horchata is for Will one do. thing. There's no way that's gonna be bitter because it's freaking horchata. Yeah. Secondly, exactly. I hope you don't like care about getting diabetes. Because <laughs> horchata it's is just so syrup it's and so milk. Oh. So what is horchata? Because I've it is I, cinnamon I've... rice milk. Okay. Huh. Yep. And that... a lot of sugar. And but yeah, the slushy at that place has rum in it, so that's fine. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, Solid Sneaks is asking warmer chilled sake. It does depend on what you're eating and depends on the mood. Uh, oddly enough, on like. After a warm day, I actually kind of crave warm sake for some reason. There's got to be some kind of logic in there, because Moose, weren't you saying that in some countries where they don't quite have air conditioning, people will drink hot stuff to sweat because they think they can like sweat it out or something? No, it's true. In India, they drink hot tea when it's like 90 plus degrees because it, it actually lowers It helps lowers them your... perspire or something? Yeah. And it's I know like... that... Uh, yeah, amongst... Um... Amongst many uh, cultures, too, it's also a thing because the they don't have clean sure. enough drinking Taxi. water and stuff, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, that was a thing a while, a long time ago, too. Like, people on ships would drink 3% beer because that was just the only safe liquid to drink. It's true with spicy meat, too. Though so I do know that the they say that you don't want to have ice cubes in a lot of places because the water from those will be contaminated. And people uh, are like, yeah. oh, I'm drinking a soda. I'll be fine. But no, the soda has ice <laughs> cubes with the contaminated Ooh. water in it. Your shock skags are pain. They are quite oh, bad. My battery is running low. Did it not? <laughs> I'm starting to feel like Power. yes, left behind um, technology-wise because I've noticed slowly on my way to work that almost everyone is switching the AirPods. Uh, and like, yeah, what we all making fun of these like a year really ago? Big. AirPods. Yeah. Well, it's because you have to have them if you have a modern iPhone, and since uh, people like to trade up, you have to have AirPods. Well, that was yeah, the thing, though. They were saying that they're like you have to jump through hoops that they don't really explain to even recycle them so they're just they're very like airpods are the opposite of environmentally friendly mm -hmm. yep. very unfortunate well, because like, they, they're also they designed to not last more than a year or so what that's uh, yeah, terrible it's planned deprecation yeah planned yeah. deprecation for something Illegal. that is the only way to safely dispose of it is to send it to apple 
And they claim that they will send it to people who are like specialized in handling electronics waste. And her researcher. they just of add it to their refurbishment Dr. shop Sanders. and then they resell them. The I hope. The only thing is they say the way they built them, it makes it near impossible to actually open the AirPods and remove uh, the battery or whatever. Well, that's like Apple's What are the AirPods MO? again? Are they what people put in their ears or is this something yeah. else? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's the yeah, it's earphones like wireless. that wires. <laughs> Earphones look, without wires. Right, that's because so they silly. They took away the audio jacks. That's what it was. They yeah. um bravely took away yeah. the audio jacks. So br so brave. Oh, so brave. Is there a way to go back and re-listen to a echo log? Oh, uh, so, uh yeah, uh, there is. Hold on, let me let me hide in this building. Because um, Jack think... just interrupted himself, and I was actually kind of curious <laughs> what he was saying. Um... Oh yeah, they, in this area they do that. Actual chat. Actual like event log, I don't remember. I want to say there is one in chat can help us. Yeah, planned obsolescence. That's uh, obsolescence. That's the obsolescence. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing. Like if I, if I got laptops. AirPods, I would just lose them. Yeah, laptops and uh, pretty much smartphones in general nowadays. Like I'm afraid. My phone is in such a bad state, and Moose is in an even worse state, but, like, I'm just kind of afraid to upgrade. I don't want to upgrade mine because mine is about a four-inch diagonal screen, and now everything is going, like, this is a five-inch, six-inch phone. <laughs> and it's just like, uh, I don't want yeah. something that can't fit in my pocket anymore. Have you also ever, like, looked back, uh, like, maybe you kept an old phone for some reason, yeah, and then I you do. randomly found it, and you're like, for some reason, okay, so... I found my first ever smartphone in our closet a while back, and it was after I had had, you know, like Samsung's big screens and stuff. And I looked at it, and the screen was like the size of an ant, and it made me really anxious. I was like, what? How did I ever use this? It's a, it's so tiny. What I think is funny is right before smartphones came out, uh, everyone's trying to make flip phones as tiny as possible. Oh, yeah. And I remember the, this ad for this phone like at the end of like flip phone life and it was like the phone sitting next to a piece of sushi and it was the same size oh, wow. and i was like i want that phone and then like two months later they were like mm, you gotta have a smartphone and i was like dang it i want the cute tiny phone yeah oh. my friend actually has one of those really mini phones that yeah it there it looks like a thumb drive it's yeah almost as small but well, that's a little too small <laughs> Yeah, because uh, you, you pretty much have to do your texting like you would I mean, on like, a... My mom's phone. living both worlds because she's got like a huge screen phone, but then also she talks to me through her Apple Watch. Ah. And I don't <laughs> like it because every time I call her, she picks up, she's like, hey, and I say something, and then everyone else in the background is like, hey, and I'm like, this was supposed to be, I'm calling you, mom. Oh my God, my brother and family. I were complaining about that. Ever since my dad got married, he can never call just him. Gotta call like, him hey, Dad, wife. he's like, hey, and these are saying something, and it's, hey, Tanley, and I'm like, oh, hey, hey, you, I didn't know you were there. That was, that was my mother when she got a job, is then she was unavailable to be called outside of, uh, well, like, during work time. Yeah. And so, like, it used to call her a lot when I was in college, because it was just like, yeah, I mean, she's just home. And now it's just like, all right, so I can only call her when she and everybody else in the house is off of work, so it's everybody's like kind of clustered around my mother's wow. smartphone uh, <laughs> on speakerphone trying to communicate with me, and it's just like, oh my god, <laughs> am I it's, just soloing Toomba? There we go. Uh, we. About to get you, about to get you, about to get you. No, 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 uh, no, no, no. What happened? Uh, I jumped, I, I jumped to try to get to you, and I bounced on your head, which prevented me from reviving you. <laughs> That's so pretty sad. great. Oh uh, Jazzy God. reminded me, uh, small phones is a good Zoolander joke when he holds out a phone that's the size of a Listerine strip. <laughs> uh, oh. oh my God, the grenade uh, mod I picked up a little while ago is like my my super weapon. I, I finally got a super duper shotgun that makes a bunch of shotguns that track in on people, except it's a grenade. I mean, it's not literally that, it's just, you know, it's a good weapon. Oh. Oh, finally I got a good weapon. I'm just saying, I got a weapon that kills shields, so if we find a monster that has, like, crazy stubborn shields, I know a guy, and the guy's me. <laughs> is that a rocket launcher? Somebody just let... No, it's a Spitfire. Was Hello. that a yellow? 
No, it was, well, orange? I don't know. Yellow, yeah. You look like you need healing. It is a shotgun machine gun. That's exciting. My college years, I remember being fond of my little flip phone because I'd pretend it was a Star Trek communicator. You, <laughs> you know, like flip, flip it open. Nerd. -doo -doo. Nerd. On a Bluetooth like uh, headset that looks like a Dragon Ball power level scouter. I'm sure that exists. But, like, <laughs> I'm kind of sad that I haven't already acquired this in my life. That's what I want for I'm... my birthday. Is it too late to ask for that for my birthday in two days? Yes. Though? Yes, okay. it is. Next I mean, if, if you wanted to, you could probably take an Apple Watch, cut the wristband off, yeah. strap it to your ear, and then <laughs> and then just have some, like, okay. transparent whatever. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. All I well, gotta do I is. I had a razor phone that I constantly lost in the couch oh, cushions. Ooh. <laughs> Terrible. Thought it was cool, though. Oh. oh my god. These guys are everywhere! Yeah, you know. Infinity. Just more guys to get that... More folks to get that heal off of. Wow. So, you know how I gave one of you that revolver that, like, does a ton of damage, but fires yeah. really slowly? Well, I got a new one, apparently. It has a two-bullet clip capacity. It is miserable. I fire. Oh, no. I miss twice, and then I have to reload over like two seconds. And it's like, <laughs> who would use this game? This is an EDF yeah, gun. That's, that's not it's an EDF <laughs> gun. Yeah, it is absolutely an EDF gun. <laughs> You've been playing four, wow. right? Or at least to yeah. some degree. Yeah, yeah, yeah the four point one. I'll... Have you gotten trapped by any of the weapons that like never reload or anything like that? Because like those are awful. <laughs> yeah, you have to. There, are, there are some things that you just can't read about, and you just gotta suffer through. Luckily, okay. luckily, that's actually the only that's that's the main one where that's actually an issue. Once you get up to five in Iron Rain, it actually like they're barely an issue anymore. They just kind of actually are good weapons, or you very much know because it labels it as like you can't reload this, and you're like, thank you, thank you for that warning. <laughs> Man, I gotta get one of those games. Four point one's been really fun though. Either way, uh, like. Yeah, yeah well, quite the spirit of it. Four point one is great. Uh, at some point, I would love to just like grab people and be like, we play EDF for like an afternoon. That'd be cool. Yeah. Dude, look at all these relics, guys. Uh, oh. which? Oh, in one of the uh, machines. I mean, Are they just basic ones? By the looks the of it. The protection relic isn't terrible. Hey, Shell, you're an assassin, right? Yep. You're a zero, right? Uh, mm -hmm. okay. So I've got this class mod that has some like pretty swift HP regen. I don't know, maybe it's good. Let me see let me see if I can trade. How do we trade? Let me see. My current one is just a resistance relic which is just 22% against incendiary mm. stuff. So Well, this is a class mod for assassin. This one gives you Oh, class mod. Sorry. My class mod yeah. is currently just 102 max health and health regen of 2.9. Okay. Does it boost any skills underneath that? Um, plus two on the Grim skill. Then I have something that is literally that, but just better. Okay. Cool. So if we can figure out how to trade, it'll be a good. Oh, here we go. Hold extra. Or you just drop it. Well, I don't trust this game because last time we tried, no, two times. Yeah, we tried I just to drop threw it through the world. world. Oh, I yeah. see. Okay, hold X to accept. Okay, so here I go. I am. I don't know if I have anything that I can offer. I mean, you don't have to offer anything. Why can't I like move this? Do I have a class mod that is the heck for... did I just do? I'm an assassin. No, only assassin class mods. Can I not trade because my inventory is full? What is happening right now? I can't put this in the empty slot for some reason. Oh, maybe it's because I'm still in here. Oops, sorry. Let's reinitiate the trade. No, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. We'll figure this out. Every time I do trade, because I only do... I swear, I only trade maybe like once every game. Enter is select. Uh, it just says inventories. Yeah, maybe I can't do a trade because my inventory is full. Let me. Uh, am I just selling something somewhere? Over here. Okay, here we go. I thought I got rid of all my stuff, but. Better, I, I, I need to yet. get stuff out of my inventory as well. So. Let me see. Okay, now I'm for real definitely good. You go okay. ahead and empty if you need. I just need to get stuff out of mine. Uh, 
Juan, are you okay out there? Yeah, I'm. They just keep, fighting everything on his own. They just keep <laughs> chucking robots at me, and I keep shooting the robots. Yeah, this thing went to dying. Well, as long I, as you're okay. well they dr they literally dropped a robot on my head. That that hurt a bit more. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay, here we go. How did you get there? Here we uh, go. I walked here. I'll go stand next to the entrance. Select. There. For some reason, specifically in trading menu, you have to use enter instead of click. But uh, yeah, here we go. Okay. Let's That's see. Interesting. Over over here, Moose. Oh, okay. oh finally. We did it. Yeah, let's see. Let me put the next one. Nice. Oh, you're up there. We'll come. Yeah. Ow. The way. Help is on the way. There we go. Nice. Oh, plus <clears throat> that dropped all the health orbs. So when he came back, he came back nice and E. So I actually regen health pretty quick on my own just because of how oh, much sweet. HP I have. Because <laughs> I, I heal, I think, half a percent of health every second. And so okay. I've just been... Every badass rank I get, I just put it into max health if I can. So I'm at like Thanks. 900? <laughs> Bloodwing should be in one of these cells. Don't worry about Ooh. the uglies and the other ones. They we could kill some spider ants for just bonus stuff. Spider ants? Where did spider ants at? Does whatever a spider ants does. Does what a spider can, up. and also what an ant can. Probably from the console. Oh the god, screen. this sounds horrifying, dude. Basing it off of names. Watch out, it's spider ant. <laughs> Imagine, like, smart spiders that work together. Ugh. I don't uh, know there actually, actually, there actually are some well, spi species of spiders that have these colonies. I was also going to say there's a there's a Spider Man called Spiders Man. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> that is, oh dear. he is he is literally a colony of sentient spiders in the shape of a Spider Man that Ouch, think that they are Spider Man. It's oh. like one thousand Ant Man from it's a, yeah, Rick and it's a, Morty. It's a million ants from that episode of Rick and, Rick and Morty with the uh, well now I can't remember what the names were. Oh, I just watched that episode. Super Friends, but that's a real thing. <laughs> Wait, did I just open up all these boxes and they had robots inside? Yeah, them? they oh, did. My ah! God, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot more stuff happening than usual. Really happens. Killer Jenkins. Oh dear. Uh, here. Have up. Second wind. And oh, the yeah. jet loader is dead. Holy freaking cow! Give me all that loot. Oh. It's good loot. Hey, Wander, where are you? Are um, you in the room? I'm next to the turret. Man, these things are taking a lot of flying shotguns to the face. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, man. I just dinged. I'm gonna give myself such a point in shield regen. Please listen to me. I don't care what you do to me. Just let my husband go. He's it's Shin's team. He's no good for your goddamn experiments anyway. Just please let him go. Oh, it's so Let's sad. Hold up, Sammy. Don't call me. This subject is unsuitable for testing. His husband has the shivers. He could have transmitted. Hey, remember that <laughs> wife of yours and how you wanted to see her like ever again? You can't. Still don't hear screaming. Oh, Golly. Dark. What a rude boy. Ah, the Casmico says loot midgets are 100% a pure chance if you leave doctor's orders notes alone. Oh, from those four boxes. I see. Ah. I'm just not used to having them being like flying crazy wild dudes. I don't know if that's a mod thing or what. <laughs> oh, Bloodwing. He has his own sign. Okay? Oh, there's an origin evidence over here, but if we do this, it'll Jeez. round this out with us without us having killed the spider ants. Is that something we want to do? <laughs> Like, we could pass. I don't know where spider ants are, honestly. I want to kill all of them because they uh, should not exist. Yeah, let's go figure out how to get the spider ants. Okay. Let's get them. There's also the flame beast over to the right, but... Ah, looking for Bloodwing? Never mind. I moved her a few hours ago. <laughs> Somewhere Wait, Moose, did you pick Wait. up the thing? Yeah, oh, so maybe she did. Oh, Moose, <laughs> what? We just... Well, it's okay. <laughs> she, she opened she up the thing. She released everything anyway. <laughs> Oh, oh, crap. oh okay. That's, so it's, that it's, was—it's the perfect trap. I guess that wasn't the origin evidence anyway. 
Or something? Uh, I found a pretty feather. I'm just saying, Moose, we, we were sitting there talking about that for a while. And then we decided <laughs> to not pick up the thing. And then oh, you picked up I, the thing. I can't wait until she blunders oh, through stuff like that in D&D. This is going to be fun. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I died in the back of the room. I suppose I should what? have said, hey, I'm down. Oh, yeah. yeah we, were, sorry. we were too busy mildly chastising Moose. Yeah. Just mildly. <laughs> Oh. I suppose I spawned in close to the exit. Oh, more spider ants later, probably. There's a bunch of beehives up here. Yeah, once once Moose gets uh, like more used to D and D, what kinds of things? Yeah, I mean, I I'm gonna be pretty light for the first couple of campaigns. Because I mean, yeah, it's good. Because I mean, Moose is probably gonna be one of those people that tries everything and i know there are a lot of dms out there that would punish that really hard uh the I only thing the, i ever punish the only is, way that we would have fun though the only thing i ever punish is splitting the party and uncooperative players like people that refuse to engage those or are people the that refuse things. to role play or anything like i've told this story talk. a billion times but i was in a i talk was in a campaign people. uh with some of shell's friends back in new york and one of them was playing like a straight up racist against uh, magicians. Any like, magic any users. Any magic users. And she was oh, like, I hate okay. all magic users. And I was like, that's going to be a problem. Half, like, we've got a witch. I, I, had, to we've save, got, I like, had to save her cleric. character's life by using magic. And that was like, some contention. But, yeah, I think they just wanted to have, like, flaws yeah, built but into it, their characters, but they were... It was a flaw I feel where like I gave them... other flaws. Yeah, they are. Yeah, it was True. a flaw where I gave them the plot hook, and they decided to leave almost immediately and go off on their own. And so well, it took me, like, kidnapping them with things what? to actually get you them to You did start us anything. off in the bar. Maybe they Good, just didn't want to I mean, go that's, the bar. That's not in the spirit of d and Like, stay at home and play a Final Fantasy. <laughs> play... Here's, here's $10. Go watch a Final Fantasy. But yeah, that, that that's like the one thing that, and like I said, splitting the party. It's like if if there's like obviously danger, don't go off on your own. That's that's danger. Go off on my own. What's going go on? Off man. Don't go what off on your this? own. Today go off man. is a great day, Maya. Do anything but that. Today, okay. Your training is finally put to use. Who are these people? Terrorists, criminals, evil men. You will destroy them, as is your duty. This is what you have trained for. What? To execute unarmed men? Do not question me, child. Oh, this is me. Yeah. Brother Harker, bring the first sinner forward. Yes, Brother Surface. On your knees, sinner. Oh, God! Not her! Not her! Oh, I'm not that bad. Build the preserve to research the God damn it. Applications of slag. See, it's not just an elemental damage. Time. What happened? If you, you know how to use it. No, so Jack it interrupted Jack. Yes. Oh, okay. I missed that again. Hey, if uh, I had, you go. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, Jasmine says that Moose, she could see Moose as a barbarian. Yeah, I could too because I live with her and she is a barbarian. <laughs> it it also, is. So Moose, what would you play? I I don't know. I've never played D and D. So a barbarian. Bar we were right. Barbarian is probably the, one of the easier classes you can play because all you have to do is say I go into a rage. And that's about <laughs> that's the only complication for your class. So <laughs> Everybody else has to do like... with like spell slots and shit, and that gets complicated. This is kind of like playing murder mystery dinner, because I've done that. Are you asking if playing D and D is like playing dinner murder mystery? Yeah. Well, I mean, kind of depends on the campaign. Sometimes yeah. you have to go just kill like a shit ton of goblins for another reason than that they looked at you funny. Sometimes, Sometimes you mysteries. try and do like a murder cover. mystery on the train, yeah. and then people hacks your way through the campaign. And you're like, uh, mystery train. Well, you found it. You found me out. The riddle has been solved. <laughs> now what? Oh, uh, I don't mean it's like a whodunit. I mean, like cause you get a card and it's like your character and it has some facts about your character and stuff. Oh well, you you'd have it. to make your character up. Oh, I no, mean, you, honestly, you, I could hand you a character if you wanted wanted me to. And that that might be good for Moose's first run. Yeah. Uh, might be good, yeah. The yeah. last time I did that, everybody got offended at me for the entire campaign. So I'm a little, like, oh, doing doing that with consent consent first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but were you like this disgusting slob who has no yeah, good qualities you're whatsoever? You're all terrible, bad people. <laughs> and 
I could do that. That'd be a fun campaign. He wanted yeah. to play a villain campaign at some point, but that'd be awkward. Uh, most respect. people do not roleplay villains well at all. Either you straight oh, up just start murdering babies, or, or like... Or you start to have a change of heart. Like, or you just yeah, play, like, low-key... You play low-key, like, good characters that are just, like, vaguely villainous. It could be that there's a villain that's even more... Uh, destructive than you are that's going to bring about the end of the world and then it's like okay you know we're bad guys but we're gonna beat up worse bad guys that kind of thing yeah and then you become an anti-hero is that what it oh, is team rocket is? uh batman's an anti-hero it can be oh, okay team rocket is definitely closer to what you're talking about shell I mean, also like like Rick from Rick and Morty is an anti-hero. Like yeah. guys that. Oh no! Does he do anything good? No, they're anti-heroes yeah, he... because the people you root for, but and they have so many terrible qualities and stuff. But you know, they're the the, the protagonists is, is how I, I've always. He's a protagonist, but I would say he's chaotic evil, probably. Mm -hmm. Oh, you you think those those would be like like totally separate concepts? Because <laughs> I mean, in my mind. When someone says anti-hero, I, I just imagine, yeah, like, just a, a total jerk. Well, uh, it's like a jerk, but he wants ultimate good. I don't feel like Rick wants ultimate, ultimate, ultimate good. good. No, no. He, he, in the end, that's a whole thing. Do you not watch Rick and Morty? Do you not have a high enough IQ to watch <laughs> Rick and Morty? I don't know if I have enough high enough IQ. Because... I, I will admit, I've given up on Rick and Morty more times uh -oh. than I can get, care to count. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, my computer's doing that thing again. I know what it's doing. It's doing the thing it did in the desert. It might blue screen. Oh no! It might come back and be okay. Okay, so I'm back, but OBS stopped, so I have to restart it. On the plus side, you're not recording for YouTube. Yeah, right. Gotta type in chat, BRB lol. I had to reset my, or I had to change my entire recording setup because OBS kept crashing on me nonstop for a while. Oh, now I record man. everything in MKV to, uh, beforehand, or beforehand instead of like just standard MP4. It's nice because now whenever I crash, I don't lose footage. Yay. It's not so nice because it's more or less double my hard drive space requirements, which is a yeah. pain. Commencing yeah, that's why I usually don't by <clears throat> pull the trigger on this. jumping off MP. All the problems. Uh, the main uh, file format that I saw OBS giving as an alternative was FLV, which uh, Premiere does not like at all. So I just can't. Oh, we're still down on Twitch. I know. I'm okay. working on it. I was doing FLV for like a day and then I realized it didn't do multiple audio tracks and then I was just like, nope, never touching this again. I need those spe uh, sweet, sweet multiple audio tracks, otherwise it's. Oh, well, pain to edit. I feel like it's a boss up ahead. Oh. Yeah, because it needs all the players. Uh, this would be a good time for uh, Moose, for you to uh, use up all those badass tokens. Because I bet you have a stupid amount of them. I don't. Um, I only have one. Really? You have little faith. I mean, I had, I looked and I had like 20 and I was just like, oh shit, I am bad at this. Oh no, I love spending money, so okay. I always check. Coming back online. So that we got quality options, so I don't need to... I just always Bella, assume that if here? I've forgotten, yeah, everybody here. else has forgotten. Oh, She's just managing her inventory. Yeah, I was doing some inventory ah. stuff. Still have quality options. Excellent. Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to the stream. Yay, Borderlands 2 does job, that Joe. thing. Hopefully Borderlands 3 won't do this thing. Or uh, the pre-sequel, hopefully not. <laughs> calm down, game. Calm down, please. 